Today I'm going to do a really short video on the DF64E. When you do the adjustment mechanism, it really doesn't even look like it's moving. I'll show a close up, but let's take a look at how little these burrs move. And when you're making espresso, the difference between five points on this can make a big deal, but how little is that really moving? So I'm going to take my caliper and we're going to zero it. I want to make sure you guys can read it. We're going to zero it on one of these flat surfaces. And when I move this over, it moves about 0.24 millimeters from highest setting to lowest setting. So that's, I kind of bumped it right there. That's how little these burrs move when you're doing adjustments. So a lot of people, they try to make big adjustments. They're like, wow, that's, that's, I can't see. That's too fine, so we're gonna make it coarser and they make huge jumps, and that's really not what you wanna do. You wanna just do small incremental, and it's just barely moving it, and that was in millimeters, so very minor adjustments. So here it is up close, and right now it's set on as coarse as it can go out of the box, and if you watch closely, you'll see it move slightly up, and then back. So when we're making fine adjustments on our espresso, it's really not making that big of a difference, but the difference in the cup is huge. So having this really fine tunable adjustment for espresso is amazing. And honestly, it's really easy to use. This little wiper dial in the front of the grinder makes it extremely easy to make fine adjustments. So I'm about to do a burr swap and while I had it open, I wanted to do just a secondary short video. Thanks for watching.